Welcome back to another NBA talk video. Yeah. So some of you guys still choose. Oh man, what did I just say? Some of you guys still want me to play NBA Live Mobile. So that's why I post NBA Live Mobile videos now Saturday and Sunday, which is throwback. Like almost the reason I do throwback is because I don't play NBA. I play NBA Live Mobile, but I don't. I don't buy players. I don't grind for players. I don't even do anything. I have 30 million coins and I don't even use it. But hopefully, one day I will use it, which is the end of the season. Buy the best cards. Like, it's literally be really as if I play the old season. So, yeah. So, we'll be talking about why Giannis Akumpo, Giannis Antena Kupo, never wanted to play basketball so the first reason was Giannis didn't like basketball he didn't like American football the only, what he used to play was soccer which is called football almost almost everywhere yeah so soccer right Giannis used to play soccer he had one player he liked but I can't really remember his name so Giannis loved basketball. Oh no, sorry, my bad. <laughs> he loved soccer. The only reason he had to play basketball was he left Nigeria when he was so young. He left Nigeria and then went to Greece. There he found a coach. A coach, right? There he found a coach. I don't know his name. I know his name, but I can't remember his name. There he found the coach, right? And then the coach had to encourage him to play basketball. What the coach did, Giannis didn't want to play because he never actually liked basketball. The coach encouraged him and said he was, I think he said he was going to be giving him, paying him. Not really him, his parents. Because his, parent his parents were struggling from, you know, to moving from Nigeria to Greece there and that's where Yanis sells watches some other stuff in the streets with his brothers so there the coach encouraged him to play basketball there he started playing basketball from there it was amazing his height gave him more chances the coach saw the potential in him because of mostly because of his height and knowing it's gonna be great. The coach had faith in him. Right now, I don't know what happened to the coach, but from there, Yanni started playing basketball and playing basketball. So yeah, from there, he loved basketball. So, to me, I think Yanni was great because he played with like, almost like 20, Yanni was like 18 or 16. It was 14. 14, 15, 16. Playing, playing with like 25 year old, 20 year old, 26 year old players. Like that is really amazing. So yeah, Yanis got drafted top 15 or top 14 if I said 15, if, if I was wrong. Top 14 or top 15 by the Bucks. And there, Yanis did great. And there, like 28, I can't remember the year he won most improved player. From there, he started doing better. He won MVP, back to back MVP. Now, he had like championship. He, he won a ring, which is amazing. And that's the reason Giannis played basketball. Because he was struggling. He was struggling. And also, I'm sorry. I was sleepy, but Yanis was struggling with um, moving. Yanis and his family were struggling for moving from Nigeria to Greece. And that's, and coach encouraged him to play. And yeah, that's how Yanis started to play, to play basketball. Yeah, guys, thanks for watching the video. Peace. NBA talk. Thinking about it right now, I'll be posting NBA talk every Wednesday. Or other days, I just feel like posting. 
Cause sometimes I would just make a video, right? I'm gonna make a video today, right? I would, I would be so eager to play the, I mean, to post the video the same day. I don't feel like waiting for the next day. So I just, I just post it the day I make it. But I'm trying to make something, right? That I, that I have to post like every Wednesday, Saturday and Sunday, Saturday and Sun, Saturday and Sunday, which is NBA Life Mobile Trailer. So yeah, guys, peace.